Hey everybody, David Pingree here. KTM invited us out today to go over their new line of two strokes. Now this is a bigger debate than whether you're Republican or Democrat here. Do you like two strokes, four strokes? It's an it's a online battle that's been raging. I say let's just uh, call a truce here and enjoy bikes for what they are. The new KTMs have a bunch of changes. They're a great batch of bikes, a lot of fun to ride. Uh, we're going to show you some of those changes that they've made and uh, we're going to take some laps and actually have some fun on them. So uh, let's have a look. For 2012, the KTM 250 gets a brand new V-Force reed block. It's the new style. Uh, it also gets a linkage, new swing arm, new suspension settings, a little bit stiffer fork, which is something they've been pushing for. Uh, bikes, all new frame. That 250 is incredibly fast. The 125, again, gets the swing arm, linkage, new frame. Uh, they did make some head mods, some uh, porting mods on the cylinder. Lots of power there. The 150, also swing arm linkage, suspension changes, a little bit stiffer fork, and uh, it got some changes to the engine as well. And uh, all around, that's an amazing bike to ride. The kind of bike I usually ride is a 450. Um, I, I've ridden a 450 for a couple of years, so to get back on two strokes, it's, it's a lot of fun. You have to get used to it. It's definitely a different bike, uh, but once you get used to it, the things rip. There's so much fun. The three bikes we rode today, I would say my favorite would have to be a, it would have to be a, a toss up between the uh, 150 and the 250. The 125 is an unbelievable bike, but it, it's just real hard for me to ride. I just have to mat it and keep it there, and unfortunately, I, I'm not in condition to do that at the moment. <laughs> so the 150 is really, really good. 252 stroke is sick too, so. For me to go out and ride good two strokes is definitely a pleasure. Two strokes are sick when they're good bikes. I'm at home, the bike I ride, I got a KTM 350, and um, just getting used to that bike and love it. You know, I like being able to push the button to start it, so I'm getting old, so that, that's nice, but getting back on a two-stroke is, uh, I don't know, I felt like a, a kid in a candy store, especially that 125 is, like I said, it was like a BMX bike with a, with a motor, it was just so much fun to, to ride around the track. Of the three bikes, you know, the 125, the 150, and the 250, I'd say I, I had the most fun personally on the 125 just for my style of riding and, and the ability where I'm at. And I don't know, I guess it made me feel like I was, I was going faster than I am and, and it was better than I am. But the other two bikes were just as fun. I mean, I, I had forgotten how fun a, a two stroke is and, and how different it is to ride it. And being able to rev the bike out, like I said, it makes you almost feel like you're going faster because you're, you know, just. Rah, rah just revving it out and getting after it but I'd, I'd say the 150 was almost as close as the 125 for me but the 250 is uh it's fun it's probably a little bit too much for me and my uh my manliness I, I was really surprised at how good and how smooth they are you know uh, for some reason you know, I'm, I'm fairly new but for some reason i remember two strokes being you know like real pingy and, and real you know not smooth but these these feel the power was smooth and once you figured out you know how to rev them and going into corners and 
they, uh, I don't know, I, I got, sm I'm smiling still, I had so much fun, so. And I, I've, I've been off a bike for a month with my shoulder, and after a few laps, like, you know, I've, I'm having a blast, so I think I'll stick around and ride that 125 some more. We had a lot of fun here today. I want to thank KTM for inviting us out. Thanks Jason Kimball from Skull Candy for coming out and riding. Phil Lawrence as well. You know, uh, I, I think that anyone who's excited about riding two strokes, uh, you, you've got a lot to look forward to in the new KTMs. It's great that they continue to push development each year. Um, and they've got a great line of bikes here for 2012. From 125 to 150 to 250, whatever, your, uh, whatever you prefer, however big you are, whatever bike you like. Uh, they've got something awesome there, so check out all the new KTMs at your local dealer, uh, and they should hit the showroom floors very soon. I didn't know. I didn't know about a bike test. I thought this was David Pingree 101 motocross school. He got teaching any skills? Not yet. He said he would, but I don't learn anything.